Hey guys, my name is Sediak and welcome back to another episode of City Bus Manager where we last episode bought a brand new bunch of double decker buses. We also sold all our small buses and this is literally all the buses I now have. These, uh, well, these three double deckers, this one larger solo over here. Oh no, actually, we've got another articulated coming in right now. And a bunch of articulates. I think I need, <laughs> to be honest with you guys, another parking space right now. Because I got an articulated here. I can't skip. And I got all these buses. It's all going a little bit crazy right now. It is all going a little bit crazy. Uh, we need to refuel here when, when everywhere. We can't move this bus until we got a parking spot for it. So this is already starting out pretty stressful, guys. Now, welcome back, guys. Today, we're going to try uh, and expand our bus company bigger and better than we've ever done before. I'll explain it in just a moment. But if you are enjoying the series and want to see more, guys, we've got big plans what we could potentially do in the future. Then make sure you smash that like button down below. Make sure you do subscribe if you're new around here so you get notified when more episodes do come out. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the scheduling, the shift scheduling right now. And today, we're going to automatically assign everything. Everything is all done and dusted. I can't time jump because this bus here needs a parking space. Awkward thing is, I need to move this. But then again, I also need to expand slightly as well. So what I might do for now is the street parking. We'll get a large one here. And I can flip it on this side. But that's as really as far as I'm going to be able to take it right now. <laughs> Oh my goodness, me boys. What have I got to do right now just to get a freaking bus parked? Right, refuel some of the other stuff. We'll try and clean. Uh, do you know what? I don't even think it's a good idea to try and clean some stuff. It all depends on when all this stuff is going to go out. We'll try our best, but we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. So, uh, oh, we need to refuel this bus as well, but there's not enough free fueling stations. Right, anyway, so what are we doing today then? Well, we know recently, a few episodes ago, we discovered the little hack. Well, it's not really a hack, but we found out you can make some big money in commissions alone just by running the routes. Whether or not you get passengers, I'm making minimal ticket sales, but the commissions I'm getting are ridiculous because we're doing public service lines. Well, I thought to myself, do you know what? <sighs> I think we should push it to the max. I now have large buses, so it's just a case of... I've still got to assign. I can't even get that one assigned there. I need more freaking... Um, oh, it's kind of like you have too few bus drivers. Is that is that real? No, I need more buses. Uh, but anyway, get rid of you for a second. I thought, why don't we just go to f for the full max? Every so often, I'm going to be able to afford a decent large solo bus, which can carry up to, like, you know, close to, like, 90, 100 passengers. So why don't I just go all in and set up a route and start getting all these little ones done? Now, you don't earn as much money, but all the pennies do add up. There's no point doing the Jersey City one or the New York one. I can't do that one just yet, but there's no point doing one of these ones. Because obviously, the amount of tours it wants me to do, I'm not going to be able to earn the sweet cash money. Really. So we just keep it nice and simple with these to kind of continually make us some money so we can buy more buses in the long run. And I thought that would be a good idea. So that's what we're going to kind of try and set up is more public service lines. Now, the River Project Wet Lab, which is just over here, to get this up and running, uh, we need... Well, it's going to run from Monday to Sunday, as you can see right now. Every 90 minutes, that's pretty good. So we might be able to get away with one, maybe two buses. Uh, Getting to the, uh, uh, the River City uh, River Project Wet Lab, sorry. Uh, one, nearly 2,000 buildings need to be connected to it. And it needs to be connected to at least one ferry route as well. So we've got to figure out where a ferry route is going to be. Um, can we see one further down? I don't actually know where there's a ferry route. Oh, there's one down. Is this one down here? Yes, there's one down there. It's the blue icon on the waterfront. So we can run it down to there, just get it kind of get it close. I think that's the closest one for us. Yeah, I think it actually is. So if I get this all set up, so it needs to be connected near here. Um, so let's start just there. I'm hoping that is then enough. It needs to be connected to quite a few buildings. So if I kind of come into there and then just kind of keep going down every so often, and that should quite easily fill up the amount of buildings that I needed to get to. And I need to get to the ferry depot down here, or the ferry stop, I should say. So bam, straight to there. We'll go straight to here. And if I just kind of come in hot and heavy just to there, that completes it. It's a very, very basic and simple route, right? But this should do us wonders and also enable us uh to kind of complete it so just like that 
I mean, do I, I don't really need to go back to this one here. It would automatically go back itself. Um, it is done. And I'm just going to confirm. It only really wants one bus. Confirm that. Which, obviously, we're going to have to get, like, a, um, a bus set up for the shift run. But with 40,000 big ones, it will make a couple of pennies. That's all it would do, is just make a couple of pennies. And uh, I'm quite happy with that. <laughs> I will be quite happy with that. So, like I said, I can't schedule anything because there's not enough, uh, too few bus drivers available, apparently. So, in the marketplace, if I get a second hand, I could then start to attempt to buy some cheap buses. Now, look at this here, a double-decker. If I can get that on the cheap... Okay, they rejected me, but do, do you see what I mean right now? We can... I, I mean, I can almost afford another Articulate, if you kind of think about it. Well, I kind of can't, but you know what I mean? The, the possibilities are pretty much endless when it comes to this. Now, we'll try our best. I mean, I know I'm not going to get enough accepted for this because I don't have enough money. But I would like to get an articulated or another double decker at least. I mean, this here, 92 passengers is also a good one too. If I can get that for 22 grand, that would be good. But obviously, they're not going to accept. So anything of a high passenger rate, we'll, we'll, we'll kind of try and go for it. This Intercity, 94 passengers. I could potentially try and afford to get two of those if they kind of accept it at the right deal. No. Uh, what else could I try and get? I'm just lowballing until somebody says yes to me. That's literally all I'm doing. 87 passengers. Uh, we'll give that a go. Rejected. Now, the only reason I'm kind of lowballing so much is because at the end of the day, right, at the end of the day, if they accept it, I got a bus really cheap. If they don't accept it, I haven't really spent any money. You know what I mean? I haven't really spent any money. That's the kind of thing we kind of got to think of. So definitely can't afford that bus up there. Oh, could we get one of these at half price? No. Damn, my money's disappearing pretty quick. Where is it all going? Where is it all going? Uh, 73 passengers? Rejected. No. You shall not go to the ball, Soniac. You shall not go to the ball. Right, about this new route master. 28 grand. Right, they're rejecting me like crazy right now. We're just going to keep throwing offers left, right, and center until somebody says yes. Ha-ha! We got a bus! Now, obviously, there's lots of things wrong with it, but it's another decent-sized bus. So let's get the repairing done first, then. So bam, bam, bam. Get all that done. Now, do I truly need more bus drivers? I mean, these aren't going out just yet, which, I mean, it's not the end of the world. They will go out hopefully later on today. I think they do the split afternoon shifts, don't they, a lot of them buses? Uh, no. Hold on. Oh, no, this is tomorrow. I clicked on tomorrow like an idiot. <laughs> um, okay, 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 okay. Bus drivers. Um, do you know what? I also do need some more bus drivers. That is not a lie. That is truly not a lie right now. So staff hire. Uh, I need oh I need more lock. Oh, am I really out of lockers? Well, that's interesting. I thought with all of this that I placed down, I wouldn't have been out of lockers as much as I was, but apparently I am. Right, we'll refuel it, <clears throat> and we have to build some more stuff over here. Now I don't think we need any more offices, right? I'm gonna go out on a whim and say we don't. But if we do, what I'll do first is build the corridor. Kind of go in like just there and just kind of replicate what I've done here and I can build the remainder of the offices here but leave this space open for maybe something else right we'll wash this bus and then we'll get it painted as well so I need to build a wall so if I try and replicate what I've done over here previously oh my goodness that, that's serious lag right there so one two so one two and then the third one so one two and then the third one uh, one, two, and then the third one. One, two, and then the third one. So that's where it all needs to go. I'm just going to add in the remainder of the walls. Okay, I've already messed up there. I've already legit just messed up. GG, Cineac. G to the G. All right, goodbye. Okay, so. Um, right, I'm not too bothered about the moment that we don't have the actual uh, route set up just yet. We'll paint this bus... Oh, do you, know, do you see how much money I've got right now? I could potentially lowball for another bus offer. Uh, let me see if I can while I wait for that one to get painted. Okay, it's getting painted straight away. Local templates, bam. Oh, this is for my previous company I made. I actually don't have a color scheme for this bus. 
So actually, can I load the previous one? So browse local templates. If I apply that, but then change the color to yellow, that's all I want it to do. Apply. Easy peasy. Right, shift schedule. We're going to automatically assign what we can. There we go. But we still got to, uh, some buses need to go out and some uh, additional routes. So let me just kind of get some more lockers down first. I didn't realize how completely off we are. Oh, this is not the right sizing to make it look like super good. But it is what it is. It is what it is, I suppose. Uh, bam, 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 bam. Right, that's, that's plenty more lockers, and I'm so, sure at some point they're going to question that they want uh, more office space. So let's hire some more bus drivers then. So hire you, hire you, hire you. So I've hired four more bus drivers, which I don't think that's going to change anything on the scheduling. Uh, too few bus drivers available. Well, that's a lie. I have many of the bus drivers now available. It's It's got to be the buses. You know, there's buses just, you know, bing chilling over here. <laughs> I need more buses. Basically, I need more buses. Right, I don't want to research anything just yet. We can jump in the marketplace right now and see if we can kind of uh, lowball a couple of more buses right now. So, 26 big ones, rejected. 80 big ones, rejected. 128, rejected. I'm seeing big offers here that I'm throwing in for some mass amounts of passengers, which at this moment in time doesn't really matter because I'm not really running any routes that require such capacity. That's the weird thing, but I'm gearing myself up, right? This is the difference. I'm, I'm gearing myself up right now for when I'm able to hit back on the mean streets with proper routes, um, like what we did at the start of the series. Um, oh, a bus has got a flat tire, apparently. Is it this one? Well, let me just quickly repair this. All right, tires and a light out as well. Uh, right, where was we? 94? Rejected. I mean, I'm going to get uh, rejected nine times out of ten. But that one time I do get accepted, I get to get it for such a good deal uh, that I might be able to have some money left over to buy an additional bus. So just keep doing it. Just keep rejecting me. I'm not bothered. You will soon accept an offer from me. And I will be very, very happy. I'll be the winner at the end of the day. Accepted. There we go. They've accepted the one there. But I've got 33 big ones right now. Rejected. That they might potentially give me another offer on another bus. No. Alright, forget that. Uh, oh, let me go back. Some of these changed, didn't they? 94 passengers. Right, let me see if I can grab this. Okay, I'm going to have to lowball it all together. Uh, 34, 400 is what I need for that. Which we're incredibly close on that number. So just wait for this to come in. I'm just waiting for a bus to kind of complete a route at this point. Oh, I just realized I got 45 big ones because I completed one of the... Uh, one of the route things. Oh, they extended my offer on that as well. So I've got two brand new buses that I now need to kind of repair and configure. So repair this one. Light, engine, oil, and V-bells. I've actually kind of now got uh, three buses uh, today alone. Right, we'll wash this one and refuel it as we're waiting for the other one to be repaired. But this is great success. The amount of high capacity buses I'm now getting. Now, granted, there might not be the best type of bus. There might not be the bus that I want running in the future. But it will get me to the point where I'm able to run on a normal route and make some big dollar bills. Right, clean on the inside. Still waiting for this one to be repaired. So my current goals is to get the network coverage up. Again, that will come with time. Uh, and complete 320 tours, which we do quite a lot as it is right now, which we're only going to do more and more as time goes on. So refuel you. This one's now coming out. So that's all good. I can just put this one into straight into painting. I don't know if I own a bus like this already, so it might be the first time I'm doing a paint job on this style of bus. So let me just double check. I don't have one. Load. No, I don't. So these are all new buses that I've never owned before. Um, black and then icons... Yeah, we don't need them this big. Maybe for the back. 
And then we'll go for some smaller ones here. So I'm going to do one there, one there. Replicate it as well. And then one on the nose. Beautiful. Call it the Fools. Save it locally. Apply. <laughs> nice. And what is this bus over here then? So, Oh, this one still needs to be repaired as well. So this one is a lot more by the looks of it, but that's okay. We'll soon get that sent out. So we can do some researching, apparently. What is the researching then? Reducing the bus dirt. Again, we'll go for it because, you know, you can't reduce it enough. So that's all good. That's real good right now. So how much have we made today then? 22,000 in profit. We've still got a long way to go. The commissions have been coming in hot and heavy. But I feel like I've been messing around too much with buses. I mean, this is another way in which you can kind of guarantee earning extra money is throwing the buses not being used on the routes because you get paid per route you complete. So you can kind of glitch, well, not glitch it out, but you can kind of break the system by kind of forcing more routes than you should be doing. But they're all going to go out, well, some of them are going to go out momentarily anyway. Some of them, not quite, but, you know, it is what it is. Right, let's paint this bus then. We'll paint this puppy. Alright, there's a few buses now going out. There's two buses going out since we bought this one in for painting. Do I have a template? No, I don't. Another bus that I've never owned before. So, black. Yellow. And then we need the icons. Bam, bam. Um, bam, bam. Bam. This feels like a more like a greeny yellow, doesn't it? There we go. So click and save this because you just never know if I'm going to ever own another bus like this. Oh, I didn't realize you can put it on the top as well. That's kind of cool. Right, apply you. Very good, very good, very good. So what I can do right now is our current bus routes... Actually, you can't view it like that. you got to go into here. I can force the hand to try and get me to implement more. I don't really have any buses on this, but you get the bigger dollar bills from this one. Um, right. I did that there, not realizing what I did. Insert another bus, operational. Right, you. Uh, insert another bus. Because you force the hand, and you, I get like, you know, a couple of hundred big ones for completing a route. Just throw them all on. Make maximum money. Right, that one can be pushed on as well. There we go. There we go. So we'll still need more bus drivers as time goes on. So let's see if we can hire any additional ones. Uh, hire bus drivers. Always go for the the the, the decently skilled ones. Uh, we'll go for you. You're not the, the the most friendliest, but we'll go with you anyway. So how many do I have then? I have now 23 bus drivers. I don't have 23 buses, but you've got to give them breaks. So you've got to have quite a few drivers in general. So all my buses are now out. They're all now out. They're all making maximum monies for me. Some are more filled than others, but it doesn't really matter because we're not focused on tickets, even though this is the most tickets we've ever sold recently on this uh, public service route. It's just, it's at right now, every bus that completes a loop, we get a commission. And that's what we're fighting. So that's why we put as many buses as we can right now on these routes. But it does look quite busy down here, doesn't it? It's a good job we got high capacity ones because they're getting filled up pretty quick, if you ask me. They are getting filled up pretty quick. So we've got a few more empty ones on the way down right now. So where this didn't used to be as busy as it is, it is starting to get quite busy right now. Holy moly. But they're all being shifted anyway. So that's the, probably the reason why we, we it feels like we're selling more tickets than usual. Crazy. But we managed to shift that big bulk of passengers anyway. So that, that's glorious. So the day is coming to an end anyway, so we'll get this day over and done with. We should have put more on earlier, but again, we're only six grand in commissions off from the previous day, but they haven't finished their routes or their cycles just yet. So I would say it's been a pretty uh, pretty decent day. The only thing we're kind of missing out on is uh, the commissions. We made more there. I've, I've spent more. This is why the profit's lower. But you got to base it on the revenue side of things. So as the buses all now come to hopefully finishing their loops, we'll get a few extra uh, pennies coming in. Do I have to kind of... Yeah, I've got to go back out and back in so it doesn't dynamically update. 
So they'll finish their routes right now, which they're hopefully all doing at this point. And then we'll get that last final paycheck for each one, which is also increasing the amount of tours I'm doing as well. So they'll get all done. I'm not sure if I've got enough parking spaces either. Again, that's something else we'll find out. All right, last two buses coming in. Uh, it's already the next day anyway. But we were only a few grand off, and I decided to put all the buses on quite late in the day as well. So any buses smelling? Well, a couple of buses need uh, refueling and washing by the looks of it. Uh, this is why I need so many like refueling stations and all that stuff down. I'm trying to save a bit of cash right now. Right, anything needs to be cleaned on the inside? Oh, yes, you're a smelly bus. Sort you out, mate. Sort you out. Now, we'll schedule everything for this day. Right? Not all shifts could be assigned. So, this just goes to show us that we still need to buy a few more buses. So, we'll time jump. We can't do because... Oh, there's a bus being cleaned at the moment. So, this one needs a wash on the outside. So, we might as well just kind of wait until it's all done. We'll refuel... How much for a new refueling station as well? It is... 20,000 big ones. Okay, we'll hold out for now. We're not that desperate. Even though we are kind of desperate, we're not that desperate, boys. All right, refuel you. You're pretty desperate to be refueled. And then we're going to be good to go on this day. So the rating is still increasing. It's a 4.3, the rating right now. It's just getting better and better and better. But it would do, because I don't really have any stress. <laughs> Which is, uh, you know, amazing. All right, you need to be refueled. All right, okay. So this next day, then, we're hopefully going to buy a few more additional buses as well. With the money that we are going to be making. We'll try and refuel this bus next. There we go. Oh, this one could do with refueling as well. I will need another gas station, but, you know, we, the buses are slowly going out too as well. I wonder if this one will go out before I can refuel it. If not, we'll just refuel it when it comes back in. But hey-ho, there we go. Alright, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So you can kind of get a head start with trying to, you know, fill in a few more routes. Because it will tell you if a bus is available to do it. Like, already assigned. Already assigned. This one's operational, so I can kind of throw that one on. Uh, it probably, I don't know if it will miss its current, like, uh, assignment or anything like that. But if I just throw it all on, try and get the vast amount of money being made pretty early. And just get a head start on that money grind. Get a head start, because the way, the way it's currently set up, I only, I don't get paid for selling tickets anymore. I mean, that game plan is now completely out the window. So it's not a case of making sure I've got adequate buses for a certain time of day. That doesn't bother me anymore. You know, all that bothers me right now is getting as many buses out as possible. And then by that logic, you could say, well, then just buy a bunch of CETOs. But the problem is, if you don't fill the capacity too much and it's going negative, they might take the route off you. So you've also got to be kind of careful. Uh, you got the Jersey City here sending me a message. Um, we hope plan change of route one will not cause too much inconvenience. Uh, we are not satisfied with the current edge. This is three days ago. So, you know, i got to apply to the contractual agreements otherwise they'll kick me off. That's what stopped me from buying a bunch of sea toes and just running them for days. <laughs> so, like I said, we'll make money anyway. They're already getting pretty busy. So, I, the fact that it is busy is good for us because, we'll, we'll, you know, we'll get a few ticket sales. But... It ain't the be all end all. We made four grand in ticket sales on the previous day. I mean, granted, they are low ticket prices. They're the lowest I can make them. I could probably double them, make even more money. But that's not what I'm trying to do right now. I'm just trying to uh, do as many uh, kind of revolutions, revelations. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> I don't know what the word I'm looking for right now. I'm just trying to get as many buses to complete their loops as possible. It's all I'm trying to do right now. And that money will just slowly come in. So we're already six grand in revenue. So times that by 10, we'll match the previous day and the day before that as well. So while that money comes in then, while that money comes in, there's nothing else for me to technically research at the moment. I mean, I could get some more solo bus and double deckers, but I'm just trying to focus on making the big dollar bills. I can expand the premises, but at the minute, it's not a issue for me. 
And then we need to expand the area of operations at some point, but that will come when I get more coverage. So it is really just all about grinding the money out. So hopefully we can keep up our, uh, oh, no fault shifts. See, that's an issue right now because the, the amount of stuff I've been canceling recently and the fact that uh, I set up that new, oh, that's a point, that new route. I don't have a single bus on that route. <laughs> then again, I don't know what time of day that, that runs. So that's classed as route two, isn't it? It is classed as route two. So do I see any route twos in all of this? Um, yes, yeah, so a route two there. So one does start on it, so we shouldn't see anything cancelling. But we'll see. Right, bus is coming back in anyway. Any of them need to be sorted out in any way, shape, or form. I mean, we, we can wait with that one. It's no, no biggie, no issue. So, do I then throw the buses back onto the lines? Uh, no buses available just yet. So, these are all assigned to go back out in just a moment. Uh, okay, then. So, while we're waiting for that, then, Marketplace, second hand, can I grab another cheap bus? 42 big ones? Rejected. Oh, my heart will bleed forever. Uh, 72 big ones here, down to 15. I definitely can't under that one. Uh, send offer for this. Rejected. Offer for this. Accepted. So that's probably a smaller bus than I would have liked. But again, it's it's an additional bus nonetheless. So we'll get it repaired first. Um, there we go. Get all that stuff done. And then we'll sort the rest of it out. There's some stuff here that needs to be scheduled, but again, this is the reason I'm missing more routes. I need more money. Right, okay, so with that 25 big ones I've currently got, can I assign some, or well, try and snipe a couple of smaller-ish buses for cheap? Right, one of these here. Rejected. Uh, how low can I go on this? 36,000. Okay, definitely can't snipe that one. The new Ramos, 55 passengers. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't know why I'm trying to bid for that. I'm just kind of getting a little bit desperate there, aren't I? I'm going to slightly ease up on that. Um, okay, we'll wait for a better deal. We'll focus on trying to fix this first. We'll focus on trying to fix this. Wait for a few more buses to, to complete their circuits to get a few more pennies in the bank. Right. So, let's clean it, refuel it, paint it. That's going out soon as well. So, I've got to make sure that I refuel it. It'll probably get sent out before I can actually repaint it. That's probably what's going to happen with this bus. But I'm still buses short anyway. Alright, get it refueled, and it'll probably skadoodle out of here. Uh, right, so while we wait waiting then, uh, marketplace for the buses, anything I can buy cheaply? This intercity here? Accepted offer. Very good, sir. Very good. I'm going to need some more medium parking spaces too. So first start by getting it repaired. There we go. So that's going to run out in a moment anyway. It's going out now. So I'll repaint that when it comes back. So still got a delayed assignment right now, so there's not really a fat lot I can do about it. I can try and reschedule some buses, but I don't know how that's going to work or play out. That bus is just picking up that delayed one we just had as well, so... We're right on, we're, we're right on the edge for almost having enough buses. We're almost there. We are almost there. But it's not every time we get money, I spend it. <laughs> you know what I mean? So we are going up to the weekend soon as well, where the revenue is going to be considerably a lot higher, which is what I'm trying to take advantage of, the money coming in as much as I can right now. Right, clean on the inside. We'll refuel that puppy. And then we'll send it back out. Right, there we go. There we go. Big buses, boys. Big buses, big problems. That's what they always say, right? Uh, we're almost halfway to completing that 320 tour successfully. Uh, just refuel this because that is going to head... That next shift? Oh, he's already missed that next shift by the looks of it. How dare you? 
Well, I've tried to reassign. The day's kind of cracking on a bit right now. So we'll see if we can throw those buses on the uh, on the route to try and maximize what we can get out there. Uh, make as much money as we possibly can. So I think then we've got a few buses up here we need to kind of then throw in. So on those routes, insert the buses. Oh, all three of these I can throw in as well, and they'll kind of pick up a few additional passengers. Insert you. So that should be all my buses. Is this one assigned to go out in a minute? Yes, it is. Okay, it's assigned to go out at um, 7.45. So that's good to know. That is good to know. And I'm going to expect my rating to drop again at some point. I, I am going to expect it to see it drop. But lots of new buses on the routes right now. So let them do their thing. Complete their circulations. Make me that sweet, sweet cash. Uh, I have a feeling that this might be the most money I've made in a single day on the game. I just have that feeling that's what's happening. Why what is my best day anyway? So my best day is literally two days ago. <clears throat> when I made an income revenue of 66,000. Now today so far, 58,000. We're 8,000 behind it. Well, 8,000, 9,000 if you can round it up. And we still got a lot of the day remaining. So that's quite exciting. There's a load of buses here about to finish their uh, circulation. As they all now come in. And then where does that put me? So that puts me now, look at that. We're going to overtake. This is going to be our best day to date because I'm just, you know, playing the system. I'm playing the game. I'm throwing as many buses on these routes as I can because that is ultimately how I get paid right now. I get paid. Okay, there's no additional buses. Um, I only get paid for completing routes. And if I get paid for completing routes, then just complete as many routes as I can, no matter how many passengers I carry. So it's been recently the best day in ticket sales. That's good to see. Um, subsidiaries is high. Again, we're getting to the point that, there we go, we're now having the best day ever. The best day ever, boys. On everything. Well, not not tickets, because obviously we would have sold more tickets at the start. But in more recent affairs for public service lines, we are doing so good. So good. But it does have a knock-on effect. Obviously, our, our drivers are going to be super like demotivated and stuff like that. So it's like where you win with one, you lose with the other. You know what I mean? They'll never truly all be happy. <laughs> you can't satisfy everybody. Right, okay. So we should start seeing buses uh, coming back soon. Oh, these buses are going out. We've got even more routes to complete. So how far could we take this day? 72,000? That's ridiculous money. We're going to get to a point where we're making 100 grand in a day. We really are. So I'm going to assume that these buses are now done for the day. So we'll start to clean these. I'll refuel that one. I could send them straight back out. But, I, you know, I'll give it a rest. Start making some progress on sorting all these guys out. Getting them all cleaned and prepared for the next day. All the basic stuff needs to be done. And then tomorrow's going to be Friday. The last day of the week before the next two consecutive days, Saturday, Sunday, are shocking. I say shocking like I don't make any money, but, you know, they're the worst days. Well, let's paint this bus. Let's get it all done and dusted. Finally sort that out. I don't know if I've actually owned one of those buses before. I mean, I'm, I'm losing track of what buses I do own. So, bros. Oh, we got one. Yep, we've definitely got one, boys. Apply and apply. Very good. Very good, sir. Give that bush a little wash on the outside. Yes. So are they still doing this route? I mean, uh, I don't really know what the times are. Look at the amount of people waiting at these stops. They are not going to be happy. 
Is it at this moment that I start to change the ticket price? Do I care enough? I'm going to double all the ticket prices. Maybe that would discourage a lot of people coming out, thus stop overloading my bus stops. See what happens. What's the worst that could happen? Nobody buys a ticket? And I'm only left with making commission money? Oh, poor me. <laughs> I mean, poor me. Look how much debt I'm in. <laughs> oh my goodness me. That's a lot of debt. Anyway, the day's going to end shortly. We're going to paint this bus. We'll get this bus here washed on the outside. I think we might want to wash that bus on the outside as well. Now, have I had one of these buses before? Oh, it's that one where I have to change it to yellow. I should really change. Save the template, but it is what it is. I might need to also buy some more medium stops. I'm I'm sh I'm like ninety nine percent sure I need to buy some more medium stops. I'll buy two. I'll buy two just in case. So definitely needed that extra one, and I'm sure there's gonna be more buses on the way in. I'm not too sure. So is there still more buses doing loops? Loop the loop loops? No, I can definitely time jump right now. So that bus comes in. So let me assign first. Sign everybody. Time jump. Uh, waiting for another bus. Now is that's got that's got to be a large stop, hasn't it? That's the only thing I'm kind of missing there. So large. So until I do expand the depot a bit more. This is just how it is. And I can't time jump until this bus is actually parked up correctly. Oh, wait, what are you doing here? That's why I need another large stop, because you've stolen <laughs> a freaking parking spot. That's the reason. Oh, my goodness me. Right, next day is, or oh, has arrived. And it is a Friday. And we, I'm not going to say we're going to complete these tours. We probably won't complete that till Sunday now because of their slow days. But we're doing pretty all right. So they've changed some of the routes from Monday to Friday. Uh, current first ride, new first ride. They want an extra start, an extra hour in the morning. They really are enjoying this route, aren't they, guys? They really are. Um, can I buy something cheap then? So I've got 44 big ones in the bank. Let's see what I can kind of get. Rejected. Try and go for high capacity. Just just aim for the stars and you might land on the moon. Oh, accepted! I landed on the moon! <laughs> so that bus itself there needs a large um, parking spot. So I might have to wait until one of these go, which I think one's about to leave right now. I never freaking articulated. I don't know how I feel about all these articulateds. I really should have more double deckers. Um, okay, so repair. Yeah, there's a lot more wrong with this. So repair that. And hopefully we'll get that on the road as well. So I'm going to need to reposition this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to build mode right now. We're going to reposition you. And if I just put it there, because it doesn't cost us any money to do that. Street, build the street. And then reposition you again. I was hoping... Yes, I can. I was hoping I can get it sideways, which that is perfect. And then... can I, I can get another large stop just here. Because I, I now technically need it. Um, still only running on one gas station. It's not the best ideas. Repairing over here. This repair is almost done, by the way, as well. Which is glorious. So that repair's now done. And we will clean on the inside. We'll refuel it. We'll paint it. And then we'll send it out of here. Glorious. <laughs> it sounds like they're flushing toilets, but I think it's these guys over here flushing toilets. <laughs> oh my goodness me. So I think I've got their needs covered. I mean, I could be wrong. Uh, refuel, and then we'll repaint it. Yeah, I think I've got all the staff needs covered. I mean, a lot of them are stressed right now. Send you on a holiday. Ah, oh, they're on a scheduled shift. <laughs> uh, 
paint this bus. So get this done. Uh, load. Oh, oh, is this the first time we've owned this type of articulated? Very good, sir. Very good. Oh, I didn't save it. Oh, what a noob. <laughs> what an absolute noob. Right, okay, we've got many variations of bus right now, don't we? We have many variations of bus. Right, that could be sent out, but what I'm going to do for... And actually, yeah, let's let's schedule shifts first. Just get everything assigned for what it can potentially go out. Uh, current bus route sense, if I just insert additional buses. Again, this is just ways in which we can maximise the amount of money we do make. And even though Saturdays and Sundays are the worst days, it doesn't matter for us because we just keep inserting buses and we'll generate that money back. So there's quite a few. I wish there was a quick way to do this. But there isn't. So it is what it is. So with the amount of buses I've got right now, that should, you know, be able to upkeep and handle the demand. So in reality, I could buy like 10 CETOs and throw them on with these. Oh, the money coming in my pockets right now will be unreal. But, you know, I, I can already feel the game starting to lag again. <laughs> you get to a certain amount of buses and the game's like, nope. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> but that's a lot of money right there going to be made. That is a lot of money to be made right now. We haven't sold a single ticket. Let's just throw that out there. I mean, these buses with passengers are not going to come to an end, so we should see. There we go, our first set of tickets coming in. But uh, we, like, we, we, before we made a single ticket sale, we had seven grand in commissions. <laughs> it's, these public service lines are broken. It's not right, is it? It can't be right. It's hilarious, but it can't be right. Um, but they're doing their thing anyway. So once I get this done, it completes my 600 goal of having of the trophy, um, I should say, which then unlocks the ability to get the New York route. So what I'll do next episode is I'll delete this New Jersey route uh, because the New York one's paying more money for each completion, and we'll switch over to that. So we make every every two buses, you're going to get a grand over a grand, you know. So that's going to be a lot better. We'll definitely make a lot more money. Because I think I'm making like, is it like just the high 300s I'm making? Or is it the low 400s? I can't actually remember how much money I'm actually making on this current Jersey route. But big bills coming in. Um, as you can see, this is the downside of me assigning all those buses. You're running out of shift to schedule. So I can't schedule anymore. So we're still running on nothing right now. Because these buses aren't ready to go. Uh, which leads me back to the marketplace. It does. Back to the marketplace, boys. Back where your boy belongs. Could we get more cheap buses? No. I don't want to buy masters. I don't want to go down that slippery slope. Alright, low ball you. Rejected, mate. Keep doing it, and then someone will eventually accept my offer, won't they? Someone will eventually accept my offer. But none of these fools want to accept my offer. So they're coming off their shift things right now. If I schedule... Uh, too few bus drivers available? Get out of here! Uh, it's just all awkward times that they finish. That's the problem. It's all awkward times that they finished. And a lot of these are going to be going back out again. Which is just after they're done as well. So, we're still going to lose out slightly. We are still going to lose out. But I suppose that's why we're still trying to buy new vehicles, aren't we? Rejected. That's a little bit too high, that one. Rejected, mate. 
But that one time they do accept, we get an absolute bargain. An absolute bargain. A new route master? Oh. We can try for another route master. No. <laughs> Oh, I, it's got to be my favorite Buster Root Master. It has to be easily. Uh, but it is what it is. It is what it is at this point. So, it's just all about completing loops. We've done 40 grand in revenue, which is mental to even think. I've sold more in tickets today than the previous day. It's only halfway through the day. What's going on on a Friday? What is actually going on on a freaking Friday, boys? I will never know. There's an article on this route here, which will... It won't make much money like this one does. But I'm going to progress in the next episode to the New York loop. That's where the serious money comes into play. The serious money comes into play then. Alright, absolutely beautiful. And I wonder if there's there's room, there's wiggle room now to get a second hander. Uh, let's try you first. Rejected. What's the low ball offer on that? Still not available just yet. You maybe 47. Uh, 47 7 is what I need for that. Does it even send the offer? But they rejected it anyway. I am no good for them, guys. I am no good for them. Rejected. So the buses that they're providing me right now are not the best for how much I've got. Rejected again. So I'm just kind of trying to do best with what they're offering me, which is a lot of trash at the minute. And I can't. I haven't got enough money to lowball the big buses to just you know for them to refresh their shopping list. 50, 53 one, they rejected. Right here we go, another cheap one. Ah, they accepted. There we go. So I hope there's not too much wrong with this one. Gonna repair it, boys. There's a light, a router, a V belt. Oil, brake pads. Let's get this repaired. So how are we doing today anyway? So there's definitely room to squeeze a few additional buses on this on these lines. I wish you could mass assign them. It would be good. And I don't know if I don't think you can quite edit the time the, the, the timetable. But I don't think I want to because I like the freedom of being able to drop in a bus whenever I want. So up here then, it's just that one just there. Oh, this one's broke. Only oh, refueling, sorry. And this one's broke. I didn't even realize this. Oh, it's, oh, it needs a new engine. Jeez, it needs a new engine. That's an expensive trip. No wonder we are missing a few buses on those routes. I got two buses technically out of commission. Yikes. Alright, refuel you. And then we're going to send, hopefully, that new bus out now. We refueled it. No, can't assign you. We can definitely assign you, though, that's just been repaired. So that bus there is going, oh, it's going out a little bit later in the day. Okay. And then let me just paint this bus and hopefully we can send this one out as well. So I don't think we'll break the previous day because I haven't been on it as much as normal. The reason we're making more in tickets right now, I've just realized, because we upped the ticket prices, didn't we? And I completely forgot about it. Right, apply. Very good, sir. Very good. And then we're going to throw you on as an additional bus. Bam. So there we go. There's going to have a ton of buses right now running the New Jersey route again. But we only get paid when one completes it. So we're staying at 4.3. They're now complaining about uh, ticket prices because I upped them. <laughs> but it makes me extra money. I could double the amount of money I normally make. 
which is, will be an extra four grand a day. So you, you can't hate the player, hate the game. <laughs> oh man, that's hilarious. Which pays for my loan. My loan's dropped recently. Have I paid one back at some point? No, I don't think I have. I could start paying some loans back, but that will save me a grand a day, but I don't know if that's worth it. In all honesty. I don't think it's worth having this anymore, just focusing on this route. Oh, we're actually going to complete the tours, by the way. Which will unlock me the New York route, which we're definitely getting set up in the next episode. Because that's going to pay me even more dollar bills. We're only seven off from completing. Four off from completing right now. These next four buses, when this one's done, it's done. We've got nearly 40 grand in the bank as well. All right, almost done, guys. Wait for these two buses to complete. And we've completed that goal. You ready? Oh, wait, well, hold on. There we go. So, <coughs> although it doesn't give me the big dollar bills, it gives me enough to go over 600 trophies, which is quite important. In terms of researching, then, I can now research the reduced wear and tear on the buses. But most importantly, on the route, I can now set up the New York route, which is going to pay me 540 big ones for every time we complete a loop. That's going to be important. It requires, to be getting to New York, 4,000 buildings and 537 points of interest, which should be a lot easier in New York compared to how the struggles we had within uh, New Jersey. Um, shows you what it runs. At least 250 meter distance between bus stops, and we need at least 15 of those bus stops as well. Very good. So we're definitely going to set that up in the next episode, guys. So we'll get all our buses prepared. Which would be quite interesting. Refueled, whatever we gotta do. And um, we'll see what we can get out of it. I am quite excited. Quite excited, boys. So, your boys wheeling and dealing has made in some big dollar bills. We didn't make as much money this, uh, this day as the previous day. Because I wasn't really focusing on sending too many buses out. But it shows you that we're kind of approaching the 100,000. We will be able to do it next episode with, you know, the New York loop. Well, there's only one way to find out, and that is, one, smashing the like button down below. Two, subscribing if you are new around here, so you get notified when those episodes do come out. But until next time, I'll see you all soon. So good. <laughs>